Hello guys, this is Nilesh Kamre from WindowsITExports.com and in today's video we are going to see how to uh, delegate, how to assign uh, uh, permissions uh, to uh, to IT guys, uh, junior IT guys uh, to reset password, to create user account or to assign uh, group policies uh, to the OUs. So, so these are the tasks we can delegate uh, to junior uh, IT guys. So, so what is the scenario? Okay. The scenario is uh, we have a uh, windows it experts.com uh, domain and in that we have uh, different sites that is mumbai is there uh, mumbai pune and uh, kolkata okay so these are uh, these are the sites uh, uh, which has to be uh, assigned permissions the it guys has to be assigned permissions for these uh, uh, these ous so this is the big organization and one administrator cannot manage all these tasks at the same time because he has a lot of things to do uh, he has uh, uh, security uh, he has to uh, uh, do uh, designing he has to do implementation of another domain controllers he has to uh, he has to improve his knowledge as well and uh, improve organization's uh, security so he don't have time uh, to do the task uh, l1 l2 tasks and uh, he wants to assign uh, rights uh, to uh, to to the it guys which are located on these on these side uh, on these sites so he can create uh, user accounts he can uh, create uh, computer accounts he can create uh, uh, he can create group policies uh, he can manage uh, user account lockout or uh, uh, reset uh, passwords so these are the permissions uh, what we have to delegate uh, on this administrator so i have kolkata ou i have mumbai ou i have pune ou so to first thing you should have a, a structure folder structure ou structure defined in in your uh, in your uh, organization in your naming convention uh, uh, in naming convention for uh, in your naming convention document okay so i have desktop for you i have laptop for you i have users i have uh, it it ous I have desktop, IT, laptop, user. So these are the structure. This is the structure what I have in my in my Windows IT Expert dot com domain. So now I have to assign. So now I have to assign uh, delegation to uh, to helpless zero zero one uh, user. So for that. Uh, there is uh, uh, you cannot uh, add uh, users uh, user accounts uh, into into security you have to define the uh, one uh, one uh, one group so i have created one group that is a uh, help helpless uh, kolkata it uh, helpless kolkata it is a group and uh, i added uh, helpless 001 uh, user into this group so i'm going to add this group into the delegation so that uh, this user account would also be able to uh, uh, get up permissions uh, or or the delegation uh, to the to this uh, account so if uh, in future uh, i have to add a uh, user accounts uh, uh, users or it it guys uh, to to the delegation i can just add this uh, the user to this group so that the, those uh, future administrators uh, can get uh, access uh, over the task what uh, he he has to do so go ahead with the delegation control so right click on the OU main OU that is Kolkata OU right click delegate control so this is the wizard what would give us the options click on next so now it is asking for user or groups so as we have created a group
सो दिस इज द कोलकाता अंडर स्कोर आई टी ग्रुप क्लिक ऑन ओके क्लिक ऑन नेक्स्ट नाउ वी हैव टू असाइन परमिशन टू दिस ग्रुप वी वॉन्ट दिस ग्रुप मेंबर टू क्रिएट डेलीगेट एंड मैनेज यूजर अकाउंट देन रिसेट यूजर पासवर्ड एंड फोर्स पासवर्ड चेंज एट नेक्स्ट लॉग ऑन क्रिएट डिलीट and manage groups read all user information modify the per membership of a group then manage group policy links means uh, if uh, this site i want to link and leak in any group policy he would be able to do this okay so i what i would do i would not assign permission for this user okay so what what are the permissions we give uh, create delete and manage user accounts means we can create delete and manage means we can uh, update the membership we, we can uh, update the attributes of this uh, user accounts reset user password read all user information create delete and manage groups modify the membership of a group okay so can you see the uh, create computer account uh, into this uh, into this wizard no so this we cannot uh, uh, we cannot give permission over here we have to give permission on the security tab of the of the organization so i will show that also so click on next yes we have done with this okay so finish so now so this is the user account what we have to check if this user account can create user can modify membership so this is my windows uh, 7 machine i have to log in with helpless Zero zero one user. Switch user. Zero zero one. That we have. Password. so now uh, we will see uh, whether we can uh, create user account into into the kolkata into the ou into the kolkata ou so i have logged in with the uh, helpless 001 uh, user account so this is helpless user of one uh, uh, user account and now i am going to check whether i am able to create users into so let's go ahead and create test so 005 click on next then i'll set password uh, never expires so this should not be there uh, in your organization password never expires okay click on next finish so i am able to create uh, user account in the ou so whether i am able to move this user account to another ou so that i want to move it to another ou ah access is denied so we'll will not be able to move uh, from one ou to another another parent ou okay so move uh, i'll move to the sub ou like so this is it i will be able to move uh, this user account because i am able to change the properties of this user account means i will be able to uh, 
move this uh, this user account to another sub OUs of this Kolkata OU. Now, whether I am able to change the membership. Member of Heltes Kolkata and I'll select Mumbai IT as well. So let's see. Yes. So look at this. So this is the error. Uh, I I am trying to uh, add this user account into another OU's uh, group that is helpless mom underscore it so I'll not be able to again manage uh, this user account properties for another group so I'll not be able to uh, add this uh, user account into mom it group so this is the So I can manage this. So this user can manage this uh, IT administrator can manage only Kolkata OU's uh, OU's objects. So let's check uh, if we can create a computer account in this uh, in this uh, Kolkata OU. Okay, so computer. Then comp zero one. Okay. Oh, we are getting error. So Windows cannot create the object comp zero one because the modification was not permitted for this uh, security reasons. As we have not given permission uh, to this uh, administrator to create a uh, user accounts, uh, user uh, sorry into the computer accounts into this. Uh, OU. So we have to give permissions first. We'll go to domain controller. Right click properties. Go to security and advance. So, so this is the user account we have to give permission to create computer accounts click on add select a principal check name Kolkata ID okay okay so See, let's check this create computer objects and delete computer objects now we have to give only create computer objects for this uh, group we don't have to give delete computer objects because we have to keep this rights to uh, to domain admin to to main administrator of this organization okay so create computer objects okay so we have got special permission apply okay okay so now let's check if i can create computer object so this is it we can create computer object into this folder so this is it uh, for uh, delegation of uh, OU. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel that is windowsitexperts.com. Please follow me on Twitter. Please like uh, my Facebook page that is Windows IT Experts. Uh, please uh, follow me on Google Plus and all the links are given in the description below. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for next videos. Thank you. Bye-bye.